of that lead leg being a little bit dominant in terms of acceleration, all right? Same thing with Stroman, stabilize his drive leg, and then as soon as that knee is gonna fold to the ground, elbow is gonna initiate its retraction. So you have this thing all occurring at once. Now, I, I probably would, I probably wouldn't have, have even like said anything to do with this whole aspect or this whole dynamic if you would have just said, hey, my pull down's pretty much the same as my, my mound velo. But the fact that you have a six mile an hour difference, then it's kind of like one of those things that we look at in terms of, okay, well, what's the difference in your, in your throwing mechanics? Thing that I see in your pull downs is obviously your acceleration rate, you're going forward, yes. But just notice, let me zoom in. So let me, all right. So let's notice a couple things. When you have this lead leg cross here, this lead foot being crossed over your drive foot like this, now that's a little bit better posture to allow your drive leg to dictate its acceleration. So a couple things you're gonna notice as byproducts of this is your drive leg holds that, that posture, that stability a little bit longer and your stride gets a little bit shorter and the timing of this, when I watch the hand come up, gets a lot better and watch your lead leg block mechanics and your trail leg hip flexion, okay? So those are the things that I saw within, you know, within your, your pull down mechanics that I was like, oh, there might be something here, dude. There might be, you know, three to four extra, extra MPHs here that, that we could benefit from if we, if we get this thing dialed in. And that's why, again, I want to say it's a suggestion just because you, you, you move really well already, but I, I see it. Um, I see this a lot af actually. So you can see here at ball release a lot better in terms of your lead leg block. And we can see here a lot better in terms of your drive leg mechanics. See how that lead leg is kind of just now just it's relaxed. It's a byproduct of, of where that stride is. Boom. Then we land that flips up right before landing. Boom. Now we're, now we're rocking dude. All right, dudes. Thank you for watching that video. If you're interested in booking your own analysis, be sure to click that link. Also, I'm gonna be doing a lot of giveaways here in the upcoming months on my YouTube channel, but you need to be subscribed in order to be entered in those giveaways. All right. So you're going to click that link right there to subscribe to provide some more context on the specific thing that we were just talking about. I included a video right down below. All right, guys. Story day. God bless. Until next time.